field research was the the essential key that kind of held it all together, or the essential glue, I guess. And so every day they're working in their journal, and that's where the post-its come from. They're also, every day, they're writing a single word association to the experience of that day. And then they're also writing one sentence, what was the unexpected. So if you ask somebody what was unexpected, you start to think about all the things that weren't unexpected, right? All those other things kind of flood in and you start to categorize them as to their levels of familiarity. It allowed me one step closer to just be like, let me examine the space in a different way, how I view through my camera, and more be more embracing of it, really, especially the parks we travel to on our own, which I don't think you could do when you have so much to take in. Whereas when I look through my camera, I'm focused on a few scenes and it feels really good. So. We came back, we continued to meet, and to talk about what were those things that you're finding now in your journal that you're thinking about now that you've returned, right? Because it also reflection is fabulous after you've traveled. The reflection really is when you're like looking in the mirror and you see everything in the rear view, right? And you, you really start to put it into place. And so that's where so many of them started to find ways to talk about things that were of interest to them. It's really get out of the bubble and expand yourself and let yourself grow, really. That's why I think college students definitely need to leave and make sure you explore. <laughs>